Oh, jeez. Oh. Are they coming to kill you? I guess. They just chopped down that door. Whoa. Okay. Spawn masks now. I was collecting those. Can a man construct himself anew? Can a man, in unrealizing who he is, on what he has become, tear himself apart, down to the brick, begin again, are our souls just this, tiny cogwheels and clockwork, an intricate machine to serve a function that, upon reflection, we might set a new task? Can a man, defined by his actions, defined by that which he now finds abhorrent, set to sabotaging this body, his machine, until those children of his soul turn in a new motion, and he may awake to a new sun, a new year, a new century with hope in his heart? As I reach my hands to the exposed wires, I think myself this. Or I ask myself this. <laughs> Is redemption possible for such a creature as I? And if not, then surely better to die amongst my creations than to continue to live as a monster. Touche. This, that means we die right here. Yeah. Flood the room, I'll die of the flood. And remember, this is New Year's Eve. This game does take place in New Year's Eve 19, or 1899. To 1900, huh? That's neat. Yeah. So it is done. The saboteur was me, and the voice on the telephone was him. But what of us? How do we connect? Surely I cannot be responsible for all I see about me. I cannot remember. I cannot remember. All I grasp is a moment when the world split into two pieces and the innards of humanity fell from the orifice, torn agape, into my open, uh, defuricated heart. Where are they? Where are my children? Well, you ask, Gladys. You know the answer well enough. They died. They did. I'm gonna shut this place down. Burnt to the ground. You got it. Well, oh, oh. Yeah, Alex, you like children. really are the most wonderful and useful creatures. <laughs> <laughs> the unfortunates from the orphanage have proved indispensable in cleaning the larger steam pipes. It appears the matter from the slaughtering process may indeed vaporize at source, but drifts like dust through the air and lodges in the pipes, causing them to foul. Periodically, we shut the pressure down and send one of our pixies into the pipes to scrub the reconstructed fat away. Confirmed with just a shortened broom, our little explorers ventured into the dark. Of course, we can only keep pressure down for a short period, so they must be fast, so they risk being trapped and boiled by the superheated vapors when they rush back into the system. Then we will be sending their comrades in afterwards to scrape free the cooling mess. The survivors tell me you can reach all manner of places within the complex through the pipes. I smile and tell them I'm so proud. And then feed them to the pigs. Holy so crap. So they send their kids in to clean all the pipes and if they yeah. don't make it out, then... Oh well. Then, oh well. then they're pig food. And then they just feed them to all the pigs anyway. Wow. Oh, that's a lot of things. Wait, the pipes lead anywhere though. So maybe I gotta go to a pipe. Damn, damn, maybe I got a pipe. <laughs> damn, damn, which one of you pipes? Okay, I probably gotta turn that off and get past it or something. Okay, yeah, only at low pressure. Alright, where's the switch? Give me the switch. Come on, which one of you valves? <laughs> one of them. Speak now! <laughs> what are you? Just gotta. This game's gonna you. help the idiot you, out. Right? You, you gotta. Damn, which one of these? <laughs> I'm flustered! <laughs> oh, pull it out! <laughs> Shut it down! What are you doing, little piggy? Do you think I will allow you to sabotage me again? Holy crap, if I even have a pig head. Holy bastard! 
I wondered that. That would be incredible. Wait, what? If I even, if the main protagonist even has a pig head. You pig head. And he's like walking around. Uh, I severely doubt it, but with all the masks and with, he just called me a little piggy. A cleansing fire always burns, little Mandus, but it purifies and it makes anew. Did it hurt to carve out the fevered flesh? Did it hurt to cut free the gangrenous foot? Ask instead this. Can we save them? When did I say that? That is not me. That is not me! Oh, Super oh, Matrix. Drunk again. <laughs> Holy crap. Quit breaking the booze between. Whoa. Ouch. My goodness, <sighs> come on. Well, drink This is time. like the second time I wiped it out. Oh, gosh. Oh. Welcome to the pigs. That's my homeboy. <laughs> what up, pig? There's a spoon of medicine. It says. And it is a silver spoon. What did you, what you did, get born holding? Ever so painful wow. for Marvel. This <laughs> old just, English is really hard just, to read. And it's, it's a, a silver spoon. What you did get born holding. It's, <laughs> it's just like an rich. old way yeah. of saying like you were you're, born holding this spoon. No, Ever you're so, born rich. You're born holding a spoon? <laughs> That's pretty impressive. Well, it's, if you continue, ever yeah. so painful for mummy dear, but grasped it so hard. It was in a little screaming red fist. Later you used your spoon to dig a hole in, in the garden and get all the way to Mexico. And then you did eat worms with your spoon on the way to stay fat. This spoon was the same you gave your twins. Then you used it to dig a hole to their clockwork souls. And you ate up their hearts like soup on the way to keep you fat. Fat little mole. Where will you dig next? Next, I asks. You and your <laughs> little silver spoon made from the silver spine of your children and wrapped in the hair of your de dearly departed. My darling, Elizabeth. Darling, okay. what have I become? Uh, so we got a homeboy over there. Um, we go this way, yes? Okay, we go around. Okay, we tried. <laughs> we tried. We tried we our try. hardest to go around. Oh, Biggie. Hello, this is a... Oink oink, investigator. Oh, oh goodness. You can't go that way. Whoa, dropping off a ladder. If in throes of my evil, I sent children into the pipes to clean them, then it seems likely there is another entrance I can use to escape this noxious maelstrom of engines. I will ignore the burning in my nostrils from the fumes of that godless compound X that fuels these machines, and I will become the saboteur. I will destroy the pressure system, enabling me to enter the pipes without fear. Ah, oh, this is... Nope. There's a piggy nearby, and I don't enjoy it. So, destroy. Your goal is to destroy. Okay. Oh, that's a little blocked off. Piggy. Seventeen child feet. Now go back. What happened? Destroy. Oh sh! The piggies. They were very mad. I bet. Seventeen children died. It seems there? the Achilles heel of this facility. Something I clearly did not realize in my first clumsy attempt at sabotage. If I reroute the steam, I can re wreak havoc. So find another one of those. Yeah. I'm gonna assume that that steam's gone. Okay, it's not. That might fall on my head. Uh. Can can't, I pull can't this go off? That way yet. No. Oh, that piggy's anywhere. If he's even in here. Did that? Uh, nope. No, that seems still there. Go straight ahead. Right there. Hmm. Run back to that other steam. Back there. Oh, okay. 
Oh jeez, no piggy, no, no, no. No piggies. I haven't seen one actually. Go find it. I I know he he had an appearance. He made it quite the appearance. Some sort of steam regulator. I'll wager if I disable it, the damage caused by the rushing steam pressure could be catastrophic. Certainly enough to force out my skull from my head. A uh, <laughs> temporary stop. <laughs> Of this entire engine. That should cause the steam pressure to drop, Mandis, you clever old goat. I can feel this horror, this grief, this betrayal boil into fury. I will not stand. I will not be under <sighs> Troden. <laughs> she is my airman. <laughs> I am the overman. You're the what man? Break that open. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> nice. Oh shoot! Biggie! Oh, oh no. no! I saw him! With my eyes! With my oh, eyes! There's a second one! I don't remember where it's- oh, there it is. <laughs> go! Go! Oh, there it is. Can I look down? Can I look down? Should I look down? Okay, I'm gonna look down. Oh. He's, a little, oh, he's just he a little climb? upset, I think. Can you climb? Can he climb? That'd be terrible. Okay. I would... No, no, not- What the- It's steam. Oof, that was- I thought he climbed. <laughs> yeah. Me too. Now quickly through the pipes before the pressure returns and they fill with boiling corrosive steam. I <laughs> sense the machine startle itself about me. Its unholy inhuman mind coil and sick and send its dark tendrils through its conduits to repair the damage. I will return to the streets. I will fetch help and sh I shall lead the people upon the factory. Burn it to the ground and seal this evil place underground forever. Running might help. <laughs> that shouldn't scare me by now, but it does. What? Well, yeah. Holy kill crap! You would think, right? Yeah. Oh jeez, don't die! Keep going. I'm trying. Come on, Mandus, be a man, man up. <laughs> man up, Mandus. Yeah. Get in your birdcage. I will stop you. I will save them. My work has begun. Kill them, my please. Kill them. No! No, they are me. I am Piggy. <laughs> I am Piggy. <laughs> you don't get it, do you? Burn away the remnants. These parts will not process. Uh, the, yeah. the parts that will not process. <laughs> that sentence didn't process. <laughs> the waste. <laughs> uh, the grits. The system stick to the, the wheels to the temple floor. Man, how much more am I getting there? Uh, you're getting there, yeah. Doing good. Yeah, you're doing good. This should be the end right here. I just ascend to the service. Piggy Lord. A job well done. No more piggies. Think again. Playing an uh, intense horror game in one sitting is no easy task. No, no it's not. Um, piggies? Piggies. Oh, gee. What are you guys running from? Good lord. <laughs> oh, gosh, you're right. <laughs> oh, is this outside? Maybe they're not running from, they're running to, to kill. Are they outside? Are well, they in that case, allow me some action, piggies. Oh, God, no, what have I done? Have they already destroyed everything? I feel like I'm at, I am currently in a Disney ride. Like, all the piggies pass me, but don't worry, they won't kill you. No! No! <laughs> no! No! Burner's tree. Huh. Oh, that's interesting. Huh. Is this real kind of England or is this all made up? It's London. Yeah. But it's just his factory. So. Oh yeah, it's probably made up. What was that? 
Oh, oh my gosh. That was kind of cool. That was really cool. You see that before, man? No. Uh, is that like Major Piggy? Well, knock knock. Let me in. There's a note on the floor? Huh. They have set aside an entire wing of the mansion for their parties. We invite them from near and far, and we guzzle them in fire and in fine wine. Ah! <laughs> and the finest cuts in all of London. Oh my God, that, this. But Come. these chops are rather divine. Who is your butcher? Feed them up, for the wine and the grains also lead to character to the product. Keep the flesh relaxed. Opium in the champagne and gravy. A hog roast every night for the Duke and the Duchess. An actress battered and sliced, an artisan in every mouthful, an importer of fine teas stewed in his own tea leaves. They bicker and breed under the table by the fireplace on the carpet, stained with wine and fat, whilst long dead nobles of deformed grace and cold stare watch them from gilded frames along the crooked walls. We will hose it down later as we shovel them into our machine. Whoa. Hmm, that's nice. Where's the fireworks? I want to see the fireworks. Oh, yeah. Check it out. Piggies, check it out. <laughs> You'll appreciate this. Um, well, that door didn't open. There's nothing back there. Oh, okay. Huh? Yeah, I, I think I... What if I unleash? I stand and smell the burning city. I see ash upon the wind. I hear the roars of the sickening beasts and the screams as they fall. Upon the city and drag its people below for the slaughter. Now I begin to understand why the composite ingredient of chemical X must be. I also understand this. It is my responsibility now. I must find a way back to the heart of the machine and complete what I started. What? What? London's Again? burning. London Bridge is burning. London uh, Bridge. That's. You came from that way. Well, I need to go back to the machine, right? Oh, this music's stressing me out now. Uh, let's try over here. Oh! Holy <laughs> crap! <laughs> like it pushed my character back, and that was the freakiest part. I just, didn't. Do I don't that. like when things. Matt didn't do that. I don't like when things force the Girl, controls that way. Yeah, I know what you what? mean. What? This way? Yeah. This way? Yeah. Okay. Is this our way to open this gate or something? Oh. Go around the, the car. Maybe I have to start the car. Oh, jeez. Hmm. Good job, man. What? So I need to get back to the heart of the machine. I assume that I go back, but no, there's another. Okay. Not Wait, there. To the right to the right, right down there. Yeah, there oh, we go. Oh, wow. Um, what's going on? Um... They're beating him up. Oh, are they beating somebody? The piggies? We don't need to see this. Does that mean I should turn it off? <laughs> is there someone here? Do I need to turn this off? This is terrible. Yeah, it kind of is. I look at, I stand and look at myself in the mirror. <laughs> wee wee in hand. <laughs> and my reflection grins at me. And this mouth is full of... Sulfur mustards, vain fool, he sneers. Are you really so different? Do you genuinely believe your works of evil are any greater than the rest of them? You are simply a weak man, a product of his age, the same of any other. This is, this is empire, cretin. This is the killing idiocracy. Uh, uh, the natural result of social Darwinism. If you are evil, then this world is evil. You just let the blood run in the street rather than hiding it in the poorhouse. You hold the blade and slide it home yourself. You do not pay a man to do this for you and you cannot see it. If you are evil, at least yours is an honest evil and that alone makes you ubermensch. <laughs> and thus I wash my hands and take to bed. What did uh, he just do? Go to the bathroom? <laughs> Let's explore this creepy house on the next episode. Oh yeah, I guess so. Oh, geez. <laughs>